please, if it's, if it's Miku. Hi, I'm Dinah, and today's background is the car, yay! I knew if I got back home, I wouldn't be able to record, so, and I didn't want to skip any more days, so we're gonna go ahead and record here, so please not be distracted by any cars to drive by, or like any hog, or anything, or any of that. But today we're playing the game called I Want to Cheat, day four, day four, yes, yeah. Tomorrow we are doing Brick. Tomorrow we are doing the letter uh, part two and then Chainsaw Man, okay? Okay. Uh, okay. It's morning. When I opened my eyes, Naho Senpai appeared in my sight wearing a sexy underwear. Takumi-kun, good morning. Did you sleep well? Yeah, g good morning. Dang it. The sight is mesmerizing, but I have to say it. I made my mind yesterday. I have to put an end to this affair. Naho Senpai, there's something that I've been thinking about. Yeah? What is it? After all, I... Suddenly, my phone's vibration echoed. When I checked the screen, it happened to be called from Miku. Your phone's ringing. Oh my god, Moo! Your phone's ringing. Oh, your phone's ringing. You aren't getting the call? Undecided, I glanced towards Naho Senpai, who gave me a suspicious smile. Uh, it's okay if I do? It's her, right? Of course not. <laughs> but, I... What I'm going to do, I... It's a joke. Come on, poor thing. Talk with her. What should I do? I don't mind, but Senpai looks scary today. <laughs> oh my god! She said that we can! We're gonna do it. And plus, she like gets off with the freaking adrenaline. The music. With Senpai's approval, I accepted a call. Takun, where are you? You aren't home. Sorry, I went out for a while. Where did you go? Are you with someone? That doesn't matter. Anyway, I'm busy now. Can we talk later? Takun, I want an explanation. Right? Move. Why aren't you replying? I hang up the call before Miku finished talking. <laughs> Your girlfriend seems very anxious. She knows that you aren't being the same. I think so, yeah. It's just as she says, Miku has been noticing changes changes in me. That's why I must be careful with how I behave. <phone rings> Naho Senpai, there's something that I want to talk to talk with you. Huh? What is it? You can tell me anything you want. I have to tell her what I truly feel. I can't keep hiding all of this. Keep going with it. It could destroy. It would destroy my consciousness. Wait, don't tell me. Giving up already? <laughs> don't you worry. I'll prepare everything in case girlfriend finds out. Yeah, um, I've been thinking about it. I was thinking what we should do. Naha senpai, the truth is that I... I want to stop. Why would I not tell her that? now before it gets to move before you like you know it's out of hand to tell her now nah, senpai i would like us to have the normal relationship that we had it can't go any further than this just cheating for the sake of it that's terrible i can't stand it so you're giving up what a pity now nah, senpai looked thoughtful then she took out her phone tell me what do you think about this with a devilish smile, 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 she showed it to me. On the phone screen, there is a certain photo. It's a photo of me sleeping on the couch completely naked. Could it be from that day? What is this? It's obvious that you, the first night you came, that's you, the first night you came. I, I, I wasn't like this. Why am I? Of course you wasn't, but because I took off your clothes. I'm glad the, sedati the sedative worked. No way. Did you put something in my food? Why would you do that? To take advantage of your weakness. Move! What? Isn't it obvious? What? Huh? I can't understand it. What is she talking about? Do you want to stop? Well, the answer is no. I'm not letting you step back. Why, why are you doing this, Naho Senpai? If you don't do as I say, I'll put this photo on the internet. If your girlfriend finds out, I'm sure that she feels so sad. What are you going to do? If you don't want that, then just keep it a secret. So she doesn't have to know. It, 
That's so dirty, senpai. Takumi-kun, this is what taking responsibility means. Do you really think that everything here is my fault? First of all, you were the one who let himself go. The culprit here is you and your cravings. You even said that you were enjoying it, isn't it? A relationship? Now nah, senpai defeated me with an indisputable argument, but I can't just stay quiet. That's supposed to happen? I wanted to die that moment for the first time ever in this game. I parted ways with Senpai and went home. It said, take advantage take advantage of her or don't take advantage of her. I did not do that because it's illegal, that's disgusting, and that's that's out of picture. No. So why is it that when I make a sensible choice, it gets done to me? Why why? Why? What the heck? Why? Why is every girl in these games crazy? Oh my god. I parted ways with Senpai and went home. It seems that Naha Senpai had fun on our date. I did my best to look great. I'm glad that she noticed it. No, what are you thinking about? I can't get fooled by this date. I said that I won't cheat anymore and I say it over again. She took a photo of me naked. This is getting out of my control. It's true, I'm having fun with Naha Senpai, but <sighs> did I finally started enjoying it why am i enjoying this what am i going to do now first of all senpai is coming to visit me this weekend i have to do something about it miku has a spare key of my home if miku thought happened to come when senpai is in my home i don't want to know what, what uh know that would happen dang sorry dang it why didn't i tell her sooner i want to beat myself i don't know how but i've got to get back to the i've got to i have to get back that key from miku should I get back my key, my spare key? I don't know. Pass. <laughs> I always walk close by. I'll have a chance to grab it back later. There's no reason for me to drop to drop like this. So I decided I decided to go home. When I arrived, my door was unlocked. Who who's there? Is anybody here? When I answered, Miku was standing in the living room. Welcome back, Takan. Miku, what are you doing here? I'm just doing your laundry as always, that's all. Then I told you to do it only if I ask you? Oh, yeah. Anyway, I made dinner. Let's eat before it gets cold. You must be hungry, right? I tried to use what was in the fridge. Uh, sorry. I ate already. I don't have appetite. Did you eat out with someone? Yeah, with a friend. Oh, frick! I read it wrong, sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for it. If I knew that you were in home, I wouldn't have eaten out. I mean, oh my god, I keep reading it wrong. I'm so sorry. It's just so confusing. Takan, do you love me? Yes, I love you. Why do you have to ask me that? You really do? Yes, I love you, Miku. What do you mean by that? It's just affection? Or do you care for me? Come on, why are you being like this? And that's what, what's the deal? Is it, the same, it's the same thing, isn't it? Of course not. Affection is not the same as caring. That's not the love I want. That's not being a proper girlfriend. Enraged Miku jumped on top. Oh my God. Come on, say it. She forced her fingers into my mouth to open it. Say that you love me, hurry, say it. Oh my God. Miku stabbed my mouth with a hanger. Uh, if you aren't going to say that you love me, then there's no reason for you to talk ever again. I get my last breath while looking at Miku's fr freezing gaze. This game makes me so angry. This is so... I hate the random things that you could do that will get you killed. Why the heck did I die from cooking freaking Iku, Ida? Why did I die from cooking Ida food from home? Because I didn't buy a pizza. What the heck? I'll stop by since I'm close. It's pretty late already, but Miku tends to be a night owl. I guess she'll be. I guess that's why she'll be awake. For the reason, whatever. It doesn't matter when I ask her for the key. She'll understand it. As I entered my home, Miku leaped out from the door. Takan. Miku, actually, I. Hey, Takan. What was that call? Uh, yeah, that. Well, it's my fault. The music. I'm getting PTSD, bro. Did I do something to annoy you? Why are you being so cold with me? 
That's not what I meant. My, my boss was nearby. That's why. Boss? From your part-time job? Yeah, I can't have a lovey-dovey. I can't have a lovey-dovey while I'm on the, you know, while I'm working. Hmm. I see. Miku did not look convinced. I came here last night, and you weren't home. Well, yeah, I was gonna tell you when I got home. I don't stay here 24 hours a day, you know. You ignored my calls and messages. Where did you go? Did you meet with someone? Were you along with the bosses, this bosses of yours? Is not that a woman, right? I don't know. She's suspecting me. What am I going to do? This is going to get worse. If Miku finds out my affair with Naho and leaves me, that photo would be everywhere. We can't be honest. This better be the easiest choice I will ever make in this game. And I swear to God, I better not die. Because this makes no sense to tell her the truth. Um, Miku, I gave you one of my keys and... Is your boss a woman? Answer me. God, this does not look good. A man? A woman? Which is it? Freak! Why'd I skip it? Then why did you take so um, I don't know. Then why did you take so long to answer me? Something's going on here, isn't it? Why do you doubt so easily of- Oh. Why do you doubt so easily of me? You don't trust me anymore? Claiming my key back now would be complicated. It's better if I forget about it for today. I can't help it. Now I have to think about how I can avoid these two colliding with each other. You've been cheating on me. You excuse everything. That makes you suspicious. Of course not. Why do you think that? Is there even a reason for it? Because you've been less time with me. And you weren't coming home at night too. Well, I'm busy with school and work. I can't be with you all the time. Ugh. Why are you saying that? You don't love me anymore? No, that's not what I meant. Why do you may always make that assumption? Are you saying that it's my fault? I knew it. You hate me. I don't care you. I don't care about you anymore. You idiot. Why do you say that? I'm telling you that it's not that. How many times do I have to tell you? I don't care you. I don't care you. What, why? I don't care about you anymore. You don't even feel... Sad if I die, isn't it? <laughs> Not able to hold it. Miku dashed out crying. Well, that's obvious because because who is in fault here is me. If only I hadn't gone to Senpai's house. <laughs> I feel so guilty. I want to cry too. And now what I'm going to do? That's mean, Takan. You told me that you loved me. Miku had went to the kitchen, taking a knife from the sink and pressing it over her throat. Why? It doesn't matter anymore. I'm gonna die. I'll kill myself. Hey, hey, stop. You're going too far, Miku. It's my fault that Miku's mind is ill. If I don't love her as much as she needs, Miku's going to die. What do I do? Convince her. Just, just grab the knife. No. If I grab it, she's gonna stab me with it. I have to convince her. I have to convince her. Miku, I beg. I, Miku, I beg you. Stop. It's all my fault. I can't watch Miku killing herself like this. I'll be honest with you, okay? I'll tell you everything. I'm not gonna lie. Takan, you really will? This is the end with Naho Senpai. I have to properly break up with her. Break with her. What? You took the decision when you saw that dream last night, isn't it? Why do I always F up everything? Yeah, I'll tell you everything. So, please stop. Okay. As she said that, Miku lowered the knife. Great. Somehow I convinced her. I... Takan, I want the truth. I know, I'm telling you, okay? Stop it already! Why are you screaming at me? Just calm down and tell me! Oh no, finally I'm getting on my nerves because of her attitude. I couldn't help but raise my voice. I'm just busy, I told you. I'm not causing you any trouble, right? Is it really that bad? Takan, I'm your girlfriend. I get worried when you don't reply. Isn't that obvious? Takan, you've been weird lately. That's why I have to keep an eye on you. If I don't, then I start to think weird things like this, like dumping me for someone else. You're cheating on me. There's no doubt. I know it. But why? Oh. But why? Why would I do such a thing? I'm a girl. I can feel it. Taikon, you, you, you smell of another girl around you. Didn't thought I wouldn't notice. Dang, I can't read today. What? How can you? Do you even have any proof of it? 
If they smell anything, if they smell something strange when I come home, then that's because I brought I brought it from work. I work with food. You know, if you want evidence, I have it. Frick, who's talking? Sorry. If you want evidence, I have it. Here, look. The hollow expression, Miku showed me her phone. It's a screenshot of, of my line. When did she? Last night you had dinner with Senpai, right? That message was from this morning. I was awake. I know that she didn't touch my phone. Then how? You, you didn't saw what I replied? Saw so replied? Yes, I did! Because I logged in your line. I can see everything you sent with my phone. What? Huh? What the hell is that? How is that possible? That, that's criminal. You can't hide anymore. It's meaningless. You said that you weren't going to lie anymore. Talk on, you're cheating on me. Why don't you confess already? I don't know what to do! I'm not! <laughs> and what? What if I did? Do you want me to apologize? Sorry, it's all my fault. There, I did it. Is that enough for you? I found something that I like more than you. I don't like you anymore. That's why I'm breaking up with you. It's all done now, isn't it? It's a pain in the ass. Leaving sharp words behind, I left the house. I can't say anything else. That's the truth. I can't. I can't excuse myself anymore. Wait, hold on, Takan. She panicked and rushed towards me. Don't follow me, Takan. I left Miku and quickly stepped out my stepped out towards my home. I'm done. I don't care about anything anymore. Explaining everything would be a pain. I don't need my my key anymore. If Senpai comes, that won't be any problem. Everything is settled now. That was supposed to happen? I thought I was gonna die. Since then, some days have passed. I haven't talked with Miku since our fight. I've been getting mes messages from her, but I neither replied nor opened them. Probably I'll say something like, I'm sorry, let's talk. I'm glad that Miku, dang, sorry. I forget about Miku. I'm dating Naho Senpai now. That way I'll avoid getting involved in more trouble. I'm sure that being with Naho Senpai will make me enjoy my work more. I think that I'll be able to get something from her that I didn't get from Miku. If this is how you, this is why it's so scary to like just even date in the real world. It's just so scary. It's just, and then you have guys thinking like this, not even just guys, but also girls. It's just so infuriating and so confusing and just selfish, whatever. Uh, Senpai's coming tomorrow. I should contact her. Senpai, forget, forget Miku. I'm I don't, I don't even know. I don't know. Hey, Naho Senpai, about tomorrow. Ah, that's right. I was going to visit you tomorrow. You forgot? <laughs> anyway, around what time are you coming? Hmm, let's see. Usually I woke up before noon. Why don't we have lunch together? Uh, Takumi-kun, you're cooking something, right? Yeah, I promised that I was going to cook. Oh yeah, I could prepare something. What would you like to eat? <laughs> uh, whatever you're good at. Don't try too hard, okay? Move! Sorry. Oh, it's gonna be like that. Got it. Huh? She wants me to she wants me to decide. I wonder what I could make. Where did I survive from? There's an option. Oh yeah. Finally, Senpai's going to be here soon. I'm gonna, I have to get done with lunch. I want to serve it as soon as Senpai arrives. I may not look like, but I cook well. Mika said that I cook pretty good for being a guy. And I work part time in a restaurant too. What? I'm even thinking about... I mean, what am I even thinking about? Senpai just got here. Hello, Takumi-kun. I couldn't wait to see you. When I opened my door... When I opened the door, I was received by a cheerful-looking Naho-senpai. Naho-senpai, hey! Please, c come inside! Thanks, excuse me. Okay, having a little nice time after all that drama that early in the episode. Here, have a seat, please. Yeah, thanks. I'm hungry. I showed her the living and I started to prepare the meals. Move! I don't know what she likes, so I hope what I did was, you know, for her was appropriate. Thank you for waiting. I cooked a uh, a Chinese dish. Here it is, my gyoza special. Whoa, that looks great. You did it all from scratch? Of course, homemade gyoza's premium rice, bon banji salad, and Chinese soup. <laughs> uh, why are you laughing? I tried so hard to make all these meals. 
come on, I won't fall by these cheap tricks. These are frozen kiobas, right? Kiobas, okay, whatever. What? Uh, <laughs> you caught me. Yeah, I know them. I often buy them too. They're delicious. Oh, really? Did I disappoint you? No, not at all. You cooked it for me after all. Even if not everything is homemade, it's been deliciously prepared and assorted. Whatever, as long as I ain't dying. It's proof that you really thought about your common souls. Really? I'm glad. Move! Sorry. It was a pretty assorted in a rush, but it looks like Naho Senpai liked it. After eating, we went to the living to relax and chat. Um, Naho Senpai, you know that photo? The photo? <laughs> Are you worried about it? Of course I do. Isn't that blackmailing? Maybe, yeah. Huh? Does, does it turn you down? No, that's not what I meant. Oh, maybe you think that I'll get better materials? Um, what do you mean? <laughs> exactly what I said. Isn't it exciting? I couldn't find how to respond to some five devilish answer. Who even has a response to that? Who? Not how senpai. The truth is, I I broke up with Miku, my girlfriend. Oh, I see. So you are single now. Then we aren't having an affair now. Yeah. Why the long face? Now we can hang out as much as we want. Aren't you happy? Come on, let's go out. You and I. What do you think? It's true. It is. I like to do it, but I can't. Whenever I think about it, Miku's face comes to my head. I'm sure you know it, Takumi-kan what you really are. I know it, this is not enough for you, right? If that's so, then there's one thing you have to do yet. Please. If it's, if it's Miku. Oh, I wonder who it could be. <laughs> Wash and be sisters or something, please. I'll check the door. I glanced. I glanced Senpai's suspicious smile and went to the door. I looked through the peephole and saw Miku. Miku. Takan, are you home? I need to talk with you. Just just open it. She already knows. Just open it. Senpai's here now. I know that, that it's not a good moment but I felt that it was better to talk with her. That's why I opened the door intuitive, intuitively facing her. Takan. Miku still looked like he had burst to tears at any moment. Is someone else here? Don't play dumb, Miku. Miku noticed a two parachute at the entrance. My senpai from work came. You know who. I see. Can I come inside? Yeah, it's okay. Come in. Let's talk. So... Who is she, Takumi-kan? You don't have to hide it anymore, isn't it? Uh, have to, you don't have to hide it anymore, isn't it? Senpai spoke, breaking the silence. Once again, I'm against Miku, my ex-girlfriend. And Naha Senpai. <laughs> Today, I will put an end to these vague relationships of my toying with their hearts. This is the moment where my sins will be inquired. Takumi-kan? Miku's on the verge of tears, waiting for my words. Takumi-kan. Naha senpai looked ex exasperated and seemed to done, be done waiting. I... Stop it already. Just talk. Naha senpai, I never told you that I had a girlfriend. I just kept shut and went along. When you first invited me, I felt happy. I followed you and I ended staying over. Honestly, I thought it'd be great to, if we had sex. I'm a man after all. Then we decided to go out more and became closer, inviting us homes like this. I knew that I couldn't help being threatened by that photo. I wanted to break up with Miku to to avoid any more trouble. I've been acting like an idiot. I've been playing both of you. All this is my fault. I regret it, Miku. Naho Senpai. I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry. And so I... Leave both of them! 
Naho Senpai stripped us naked without our consent and took pictures of us on the couch? That's so weird. And then threatened to post it on the internet and blackmail us? You're crazy. I'm not going with her. And then you got freaking Miku who's killing herself over in every small inconvenience that happens in her life. And then she wants to accuse me of cheating. You know, I was cheating. But she's crazy. No. Bye. Both of them can go. Uh, Naho Senpai, Miku, I don't deserve any of you. No. Takan. Takan Mikan, are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. I've been hurting you and causing you trouble again and again, and this is the only way to end it. Of course, I know that I have to amend you. If you want money, I'll pay. If you sue me, I won't mind it. I just said it. I did it. Words that would destroy everything that I made. The decision that I'm taking is real, and I know that there's no other way of, of expiation. I'm willing to do anything for her pardon. Just seeing me would be enough to hurt their feelings. That's why I have to disappear from here. I'm sure that this is for the best. So, this will be our last meeting. I got the cutter that was that I was hiding and cut my abdomen. No! Taka Mikan, what have you done? Why are you doing this? The image I saw before me was Miku and Nasa by screaming. I'll call an ambulance. Hold on. Loosen the strength in my legs. I dropped to the floor. Taka, no, don't die, Taka. That's gonna be happening. Taka, I'm gonna save you. You won't die here. I'm gonna save you. Miku, what? I'm sure that I've said those words before. Uh, I have my head filled with nonsense cheating and the girls this whole time. Why did I even start to work part-time for? I've forgotten. Miku, there's something important that I, have to, that I gotta tell you. I was living by myself, struggling, giving it all to pay everything on my own. Miku, you weren't suffering at home. Your parents made you go through a lot. I wanted to save you. Yeah, everything I all was for Miku's sake. Why did I forget about something that important? No. Takan. Stop. Stop. Just go. No, this isn't real. No. Oh! I thought I made the wrong decision. That's why I was keeping through all of that. When I opened my eyes, I was in a white, I was in a white room. Miku and Naho Senpai were looking at me worried. Takamikan, you're awake. Where am I? What is this? What is this? Takan, I thought that you were going to die. The ambulance, your surgery. You've been sleeping for three days. I thought that you would never open your eyes again. Really? I felt like Urishima Taro, a brief for me, put, but an eternity for them. Where it began when, when it did not, I mean, where it began, when did it end? And what part of it was a dream? I, was everything that happened even real? <laughs> As I tried to straight, straight up my body, I felt a sharp pain on my abdomen. Taikan, you can't move yet. Your wound, it can open. I know what caused this wound. Yeah, it wasn't a dream. Everything was real. I'm glad you're okay, Takumikan. I'm sorry I made you worry. Oh, yeah. I'll quit my job. Take care of the owner for me, okay? But why? Because it'd be awkward for both, don't you think? It'd be hard to focus on our work. You always gave your best. I thought it's for the best. No way. It's okay. Don't worry about it. I want to move next month, too. I'm sorry for everything. I'll never forget you, senpai. Thank you. Oh, I'm sorry for everything, senpai. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Well then, Takumi-kun, take care. Yes, goodbye, Naha senpai. After it, Naha senpai left the hospital room. She's gone. Yeah. Guess I should go too. You're leaving too? You can stay a little longer. No, if I stay any longer, it'd be harder to say goodbye. Yeah, I did the same. Takan, thank you for everything. I'm glad that you fell in love with me. Me too. I'm really glad having met you, Miku. Thank you for going out with someone like me. Hey, promise me you won't ever try to kill yourself again, okay? How about you? Don't worry. That won't happen again. I promise. That's great. I feel better now. After this love ends, I'll walk again from here. Bye-bye, Takan. See ya. True end. Guys, the game's over. We did it. That's the end of the game. I'm not ready. I'm not ready for the next game. That was so frustrating. This was like the most frustrating game we've played on the channel so far. It was so, this, this day was frustrating. It was so frustrating and I hate it. Those girls, they're crazy. I could go on and on about these girls, but I'm just not gonna say anything anymore. I think I said everything that I needed to say. And I won't add to it. I won't. It's a good game. 
I was also traumatic. This 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 should teach you to not want to not cheat, okay? Because if you cheat, the two, the two girls that you cheated on with or whatever or betraying will attack you and, and kill you, and then you'll kill yourself. That's how it all ends. So guys, please remember, don't cheat. Just don't. It's not worth it. No one is worth all that pain. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe and leave a like, and also comment below if you enjoyed the series of, series of this game and what did you think about it. And if you would have any recommendations of any other games I should play on the channel or any uh, anime series I should watch. So, thank you for watching. It was a struggle. I hope you guys are okay. I'm not okay. I got a headache. <laughs> See you guys later. Bye.